I'm not, I'm not a musical person. Like, I can play instruments, but like, I'm not a vocalist. I don't know these things. Hey guys, I'm Jessica and welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I'm going to be doing something that I've actually been putting off for a while. I wasn't going to film it, but I decided since I'm already sitting here with my makeup done, my hair is just in a low pony, which I don't normally do, but I decided to do it today. Also, my cat just scratched me, so I have a nice little red mark right here. So that's just great, but we're going to ignore that, pretend, you know, that's not there, and we're just going to do this. So basically, a little while ago, let's see if I can find the exact date. Can't find it, and I don't feel like looking anymore. But basically, a little while ago, Kay put out a new song called Upgrade. And if you guys don't know who Kay is, Kay Cook, she... I don't want to classify her as a girlfriend because... Although you might be dating someone, that's not who you are. But uh, for the sake of this video and for the sake of people knowing who she is, she's Zach Heron's girlfriend. But yeah, her name is Kay Cook. She's dating Zach Heron. Zay is their ship name. She has been putting out... She put out one song in the last... For the last three years. For three years. What? Put out a song in 2017, and I listened to it... When did I listen to it? A couple months back when they first started, like, being like, oh, who's this K-girl? So I searched her, and I found out that she had a song, and it's really good, and it's called Thoughts. And then she put out another song called Love Me, and I don't remember it. I don't have it on my phone, but I remember hearing, like, bits and pieces of it. That was in 2018. That one got posted. And then recently she released another song called Upgrade, and apparently Zach is in the back track of it or the vocals or something like that he's in part of it like you can hear him in like one little part like the end or something supposedly but i thought i would react to this because why not i think she has a really good voice i think her first song that she put out was really good she had a lot of potential so i thought why why i thought might as well react to this one um plus i post a lot of reaction videos recently because i like to edit them because they're easy to edit and i like to film them because they're fun so it's great all right, let's turn up my volume. Downloaded. I don't know why I just didn't play it, but I downloaded it. Love Apple Music for that. Don't come at me, Spotify users. Like it's fine. All right, let's go. Okay. Sounds good. Pause for a second. This is a lot better than I thought it would be. Her first song was good, but like the production level just wasn't, you know, it's it's not great. Like it's not a studio produced song that was done, you know, with this top notch producer and stuff. It's a song that was done probably in her bedroom or in, you know, a makeshift studio that like she created. Like she's a young girl. She's not a, you know, giant artist that has you know all this production stuff like her manager didn't set up you know this big stuff you guys get my point but like it was well done for like an amateur level song this is definitely just like the song title goes it's an upgrade she definitely has her vocals are better the lyrics are better and the production of the song definitely sounds a lot better if you guys haven't heard of her song go listen to that it's called thoughts i've already heard it so i'm not gonna react to that one but so far i'm really enjoying this Sounds good. Yeah, you really thought you had a little Okay. It was a happy mistake. That's she sounds really good. I know she could do that, but like I don't really know her vocal range, so I can't really say much. Sounds really good though. I like like how smooth the lyrics go. Like, it's not like a rhyme, like, it's not like... I need to pause this, hold on. I like the way that it, like, it doesn't rhyme, but it just flows nicely. Like, it's just very, very smooth to listen to. Like, it's just, it's easy. Why do I look orange? I promise I'm not orange. Like, what? Why do I look orange? I'm, but, like, it's only the top. Oh. It's my bedroom light. I have a fan and a light up here, which is why, like, you might see my hair, like, slightly blowing in the wind. And the light is, like... A yellowy orange color which is horrible lighting which is why I film with my lamp and my natural lighting from the Sun so thank you to a light bulb from a uh, Home Depot and the Sun for lighting brought to you by 
the outdoors and Home Depot. I really do like the chorus though. This, it's good. She sounds good there with the little piano. I really like this part. This part's my favorite, definitely. Oh, here we go. The beat dropped. <laughs> I like this. She sounds okay. The second half of the song is definitely better than the first. She sounds good. Oh, you can hear him laughing. That's what people were saying. We're gonna go back, we're gonna turn it all the way up so you guys can hear the laugh. Okay. <laughs> there we go. There we go. Alright, so welcome to my phone. Um, my camera decided to die even though I literally charged it yesterday. But that's how much filming I've been doing today. So go me. But basically, yeah, no, I do enjoy the song and I think it was really well done. The production of it, why does it look like I have a mustache? The production of it was very well done. The vocals were done well. The lyrics were really good. I think everything just flowed very nicely together. It sounded very well done. I liked it. I think the little giggle from Zach and Kate at the end was very cute. But yeah, it's just like, I don't know. I think it was well done. I'm definitely gonna keep this song downloaded on my phone. I think it's a good song. Um, and I think she does have a lot of potential. Like, she obviously is just starting off in the music industry. Like, she has three songs out. But she definitely, not saying, oh, she should, like, use Zach for her advantage. But, like, she, she should use Zach for her advantage. Like, he obviously is part of the industry. Pick his brain. You know, get his opinion. He's dating you. Like, you can ask him, hey, do you like this? Do you think I can improve on this? Like, you can do that kind of stuff. And that's not weird. That's not using him for anything besides the fact that he's a person in your life that happens to be knowledgeable of it. It's no different than, you know, me asking my friend, hey, does my makeup look good? Like, a makeup artist, like, is this okay? Or me asking, you know, a dog trainer, oh, you know, is my dog doing this right? Or like, anything along those lines, anything that, you know, although it's a different path, it's not the typical path that a person follows in the music industry. Like, it's not something that people typically do. So it's like, if you have people in your life that are involved in it and are knowledgeable of it, definitely pick the brain of those people because they're gonna help you. They're gonna tell you their honest opinion and stuff. If they're in your life and they care about you, they're gonna, you know, say things to benefit you and help you. So if you can have someone in any aspect of your life, I'm rambling on. I think it's cute. I think it's a good song. I rate it a seven out of 10, which is good. Like, like I said, I'm gonna keep it on my phone. It's gonna come on shuffle. I'm not gonna skip through it. Like, it's a good song. I like it. And she has a lot of potential and just listening to the two songs, I can listen to Thoughts before I listen to Upgrade, just to kind of like have the difference, but I think it's good. I think she can go far if she wants to. Yeah. Anyone who's saying that she's using Zach for fame or, you know, only doing music because uh, Zach, she had a song out in 2017, so um, yeah. And like, I didn't know about the song until a couple months ago, like I said, I found out about it because of Zach and Kay, the whole, oh my God, is Zach da dating someone? Is Zach? <gasps> Is Zach in a relationship? The kid is in a relationship? Like, what? And so I found out about her and discovered that she had a song because she had it linked in her Instagram or something. Anyways, that's all for this video. I'm gonna go charge my camera now because it died. And so I guess I'm just gonna go take a nap because I can't film anymore. Anyways, thanks for watching, guys. If you like it, make sure to a big thumbs up and comment down below any video suggestions you might have. You can definitely always use those. Also, you guys can go ahead and check out my channels down below. I also have my vlog channel linked, which I post on there every once in a while. Whenever I do anything exciting, I vlog it. Um, so all my Why Don't We concerts and the trips I took to both Vegas and to Portland and to Seattle, um, which I mean, Portland, Seattle is one trip, but like those, those trips I vlogged, I'm going to be vlogging in the summer for the summer tour. So if you are interested in those, definitely check those out. That's all for this video. So like I said, give it a thumbs up, subscribe if you aren't already. And yeah, see you guys very, very soon with another video and bye. Hello?